103C. That's a sexy name, right? There. TF 103. Did you get all that? Did you get all that? TF. I, I got it right here. TF 103C. It's a the, okay. It's a transformer it's pad. A transformer. Actually, it is Android. Okay. Um, and it's look at this. This is, I'm actually looking at these. Um, not this in particular because it's Android. But I want this solution. I've been looking at this solution for my wife for her next computer because I was thinking, why not just get her a Windows tablet? Does she really need much more computing power than that, right? Um, and these connect. So, so for those on audio, uh, we're looking at uh, what is that? A 10 inch? Yeah, it's a 10.1 inch tablet. He says in the chat room, it's an Intel Atom processor, detachable keyboard, completely comes with it. Um, that's. I think that's. That's the way to go these days. Mm -hmm. If you're just like, I need to type things up, I need something mobile, etc. You know, and, and and some of these keyboards are fairly sturdy, and it clicks on the top, and you can use it as a laptop. You know, I was uh, sitting, I was at the uh, Office Max Depot, whatever one it is, um, and they had one of these, and it took me a second. I was like, oh wait, this is Android. It was one of the Samsung tablets, and I was you know plugging away at the keyboard, and I was like, oh wait, you know, um, I think I think you're going to see more of these, you know, whereas, you know, people have been picking up um, um, MacBook Airs for the longest time. I think you're going to see more and more people pick these up. I think you see more and more people picking up these Android devices as predict productivity machines in this regard. I kind of wish there was a Chrome book version of, of, but then it'd be, uh, you know, the tablets. Well, so, so, and that brings up an interesting subject that I was, I was reading a lot about today with Chrome and have you read about? I think it's called Arc Welder. Arc Weld. No. It allows it allows Android dev developers to port instantly, automatically okay. port I've been over hearing about, to Chrome. I've been hearing about this concept. So, and, and it's becoming because it's so easy. Think about it. You could take any app that you develop and port it to Chrome, and it'll be available in a Chrome store. And it's just it's automatic. Um, the interesting thing that a lot of people are coming back and saying is there needs to be more touchscreen Chromebooks because you're porting over touch you're screen porting stuff. touch screen <laughs> but and but everyone that's trying it out is loving it mm -hmm. the fact that all their apps think about it now your app just like it used to be okay the website I visit follows me from my phone to my tablet to my laptop to wherever